Hey everybody, this is not a spring check and the big news today is, well, what is it today with inventory and the real estate market? Wait a minute, we need to help those homeowners so they can go ahead and, oh, wait a minute, so the homeowners can go ahead and buy a home because there's, what? There's, there's a glut of inventory on the market. Oh, wait a minute, and then somebody else says, no, there's no glut of inventory, we're selling at record levels. It was, the White House came back, said that the President of the United States was taken out of context, even though they're running exact words, and that they're, we do not, the housing is selling at record levels under the President, and the market is recovering magnificently. He just wants to make it easier for those people that have the resources to get into homes. The only problem is, his plan is that the government will pay, government will cover all the costs, and you don't, there, there's no proof of income, there's no proof of, of a job, there's no proof of anything. And one guy said, in other words, exactly like it was before he became president. In order to move the gut of homes out uh -huh. that are locked up in the foreclosure system that no one will buy because they can't get the financing to buy any Well, they homes. can't get the financing. I know. So it's like, they, it's they, like the houses that I hear being sold are not from American citizens. It's actually from company, mm -hmm. people that are from out of this country. That's what they're saying too. That's what they're trying to stop that because they said the homes are going vacant. They're mm -hmm. buying the homes simply to put, spend the money and no one is living in them and they're becoming eyesores all over the United States because they're no longer owned by the bank and since they have absentee owners you can't hit them up for money mm -hmm. because what do you, they, there's nobody there to, to charge the money for cleaning the property up so therefore they're becoming eyesores in every community. Oh, and of course, who we have here today is Old Cat with comments on the headlines of today. That's who you're hearing in the background. And oh, also, it's all over for the Republicans. Oh, yeah. I mean, uh, they basically, uh, you know, they're feuding among themselves. I mean, everybody, okay, Bill O'Reilly has decided to jump to the left, even though he says he has. He's now having to put, he is now having his, whoever actually does write his books, because they're basically probably, they're co-written, as they say, is now putting out a book showing that he hasn't changed his opinions in 17 years. Well, other than the fact that they run the show, it's called Do Not Say Something Live on Television because there's always a video record of what you have said. And they say he's contradicting himself all over the place. Now he's, he's never been against gay marriage. Well, yes, he has. And he's now calling people Bible thumpers, mm -hmm. which was, they basically, they're offended by, he is offending one, one member of the Republican Party after another, and basically since the right tends to advertise on Fox, the right is basically going to be getting rid of O'Reilly very certain, mm -hmm. because he is, a, this is a man who, while he doesn't get a thrill up his leg about the president, if the president would come on the show, and the president would bend over and say he needed his butt scratched, there would be a, tra a race between Juan Williams, Bill O'Reilly, and Bob Beckel to see which one could scratch his rear end first mm. because they worship the ground the president walks on. And Obama outlines an infrastructure plan during Miami visit. Well, yeah, spend more money and hire more union people. It's not Yay. happening. It, okay, uh, this morning the market has collapsed on the fact that they've done a readjustment of the of the people that were actually hired in the last two months. Remember those record amounts, 100,000 more than what they expected? Well, that 100,000 more that they expected is now back to what they originally expected. And the unemployment rate didn't go down, it went up. And, oh, but you will be happy to know that, that three out of every four jobs done created in the month of March was a small business. Of course, the small business people are saying, oh, it's not, we're not hiring. <laughs> They're not hiring because of Obamacare. They are, you know, if they, add, if they, everybody they add is going to cost them money. You don't add people, you don't put out any more money. And youth flock to mobile messaging apps and maybe a threat to Facebook. Well, yeah, because Facebook has no. Um, Facebook is. What happened is Facebook is ultra conservative. Okay, like Microsoft. Microsoft Sky System is a to total farce. Because you can, Microsoft monitors every single picture, every single word put on this cloud system, and Facebook is doing the same thing. I've had things, I've had my Facebook account stopped until I point out the fact that, oh, hey folks, you know, if you want to read what Facebook just pulled on mm -hmm. me, go to my, you know, go to this site and you'll read exactly, and then all of a sudden it comes, the whole thing comes right back up again. Well, and Saudi orders telcos to ensure Skype. <laughs> 
and what that means local laws. Yeah, well, because they're trying to make certain that things are, um, uh, they want the internet totally controlled in Muslim countries, which I mean, we have a Muslim president, you understand why he wants total control of the internet also. Mm -hmm. And what app meets local laws? Um, nobody knows anymore. Lo okay, local laws do not trump federal or state laws. Mm -hmm. So, uh, what they're trying now is that you have local apps that people don't approve of, they're now going to court to try to get them removed. And Dell warns of risk of remaining a public company. Uh, yeah, if it remains a public company, they have money coming in from the stock people. If they buy, if they take it private, there is no income coming in. The, it's just uh, uh, privatization only works if the company is profitable or there is a means of making it profitable. Mm -hmm. Dell's new computer, which is basically a, a double-sided little thing, they said it's too heavy, too thick, oh. and basically too likely to break. In, in order to make well, it... Well, because everybody's going towards lighter computers. Yeah. So uh, they're, but then they're all going, they're all doing well. The PC, the uh, PC and the laptop are dead. No, they're not because there is no such thing as a as a tablet computer, other than that little thing that she's got in her hands at the moment. I love this little thing. See that thing? It weighs nothing, and it has a 350 gigabyte hard drive in it. And it put apps on it. That I will know, do everything this, this that a, a tablet will do. So it's fabulous, and. It is an Acer. That's right. Which they they won't. You can't find one in the stores. They want you to go to the Chrome system. Um, four heard and crash and attack at California Walmart. I know uh, because it, it basically they said it's uh, it was gang violence, which everybody knows which gang it was. It's that Walmarts don't have, have unions. Oh. Yeah. Wow. And then, well, actually, shall we say, gone with the wind ascendant, or actually, relative. People? No, not hit six, hit six cars. I, I know. Let's see. Clark, Clark, Gables. Clark, Glable, Clark, Clark Gable's only legitimate son. They say legitimate son because there's thoughts. Very, go look at Chad Everett and go look at David Niven. They both have Clark Gable's ears. Mm. Whereas I love the son. It's all in the ears? Yeah, the son doesn't have his ears, but the son has a, a little bit look like him. But the Gable ears are not with his son. And Obama hears Easter service with political themes. Oh yeah, basically it condemned Republicans. It can everybody. Okay, basically O'Reilly is uh, is saying it. You know that it's 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 perfectly acceptable. It's this, it's that. Uh, well, no, it's not because it was a one-sided racist rant against Republicans. That is not what you're supposed to be doing. Ministers are not supposed to be there doing a political speech, and it was a political speech condemning everybody on the religious right. Republicans on gun control. Republicans on immigration. Republicans on gay rights, it, it, it said it basically, um, well, some of the people that O'Reilly is condemning said it came, the speech came straight from the White House, folks, that everybody knows it, but O'Reilly said, well, there's no proof. Oh, there's no proof. There's no proof. Mm -hmm. And Jessica Lynch, 10 years after her rescue, happy to put her back in the past. Well, yeah, well, she, what she do is call it, if you're, if white women should not go onto the battlefield because men then have to be sent in to pull them out. They don't send women in to pull them out, they send men in to pull them out. Mm -hmm. And Powerball winner resolves thirty thousand dollar child support debt. I know, the guy basically he's spending money on power things, and then, you know what? Uh, okay, first thing he did was say he was going to pay the the rent on everybody in his neighborhoods. You know, twenty million dollars worth of rent. I also heard the fact too that one of the guys said that you can this man you can expect in a year and a half to be he on totally one of the re reality series is about uh, how he went through two hundred and twenty one million dollars in one year. 221 million. That's what he got after taxes wow. is 221 million and you know so he's spending 20 million dollars for people's rent for the I think people's rent for the year where he's living. Wow. I mean he could have bought the buildings for less I money. I should say just that. buy the building. <laughs> That's right and then the, the guy basically was behind on his payments so I mean that they said that and why would he and he was working he's behind his payments because he spends all his money as fast as he gets it so that's uh that 220 is just going to go, folks. Well, you know, it's, yeah. <laughs> it's his to do. Um, beef over female rocket scientist orbit prompts times to change it. I know. It, it's getting... Um, it, what happens is... Well, I mean, we'll give a perfect example. We, Everybody grumps. We grumped at the, uh, the times today simply because of the fact that we know... Oh, that, is that times? It's that times that... Uh, we know that something they're doing, the, they, they're offering tickets for an event, 
every city in the United States, every state in the United States tickets were available and you know still available for the really big cities but they were not available on the west coast and the west coast was the only place the tickets weren't available which means tickets aren't even given out and mm -hmm. they're going to give they're going to be indignant about it we did ask if they comment about it but they won't palestinian islamist group hamas reelects michelle as its leader yeah because they they uh, the people that want to overthrow you know they want to kill all the israelis the guy has obama so okay put it this way he has the support of our president Morrissey wants to get rid of the Jews. This guy wants to get rid of the Jews. Everybody that he has to give support to wants to get rid of the Jews. Isn't there sort of a, a you know, a, a, you know, something sort of forming a theory that he might not want the Jews? Islamic school fire kills thirteen children in Myanmar. Uh, yeah, uh, because they were they were girls. Mm. They don't like girls in Muslim countries. Oh, they don't. They don't want them to have edu education. Is something they don't want them to have. So. If you're a Muslim female, you leave the countries as fast as you can, otherwise you're screwed. Suspecting militants attack Pakistan power stations and seven are dead. Well, they don't have militants in Pakistan. It's, a, they don't. it's an Islamic government. They basically, if that's going on, it's probably people trying to bring down the Islamic government. Ooh, Assange appoints WikiLeaks party campaign director for Australian Senate. He's trying to take. He's trying. What? I, no, he's trying to uh, get a political force to get him to keep. So he he needs a place that will take him in. I was gonna say. And, you know, and basically, he's gonna go. Okay, go, they he basically screwed because two women in a in a country where they basically have good times all the time brought charges of sex. You know, he raped them, and they they do take that seriously in Scandinavia, folks. I know, and they're very free over there. Now, I went to school. But them. it's got to do with whether you want it or not. They didn't like Hassan, but he did it. He forced them anyway. And that's that gets you put in jail for a long time. Man shoots tree and tree fires back. Sounds hey, hey. like a ricochet to me. Yeah, he bounced off it. You don't shoot. If you're going to. Don't put a target up on an oak tree or an iron tree. I can guarantee you, iron tree. Oh, is that what he did? Oh, okay. Oh, and a Monty bubble is for the Mark Twain of the Animal Kingdom. Uh, okay. Even if it's a trusted organization, if it if it looks like a duck and it walks like a duck and it swims like a duck and has feather like a duck and it swims like a duck, it's probably a duck.